This is KEXP FM Seattle 90.3 and all around the world on the web at kxp.org. Very happy to have Mapache in the Roadhouse. Good to have you guys here. Thank you so Good much. To be here. Yeah. How about some songs? Yeah. Shore and sleep, morning light. Feel- 
Mapachi in the Roadhouse on KEXP is Clay Finch and Sam Blasucci playing from their debut record, self-titled record. Great to have you guys here. Thank you Thanks so for much. Having us. That yeah. last song was Morning Light. And what was the first one? It's called Aquellos Ojos Verdes. All right. Yeah. Yeah. G- congratulations on the record. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Thanks very much. Um, tell me more about that first song. Um, Sam, it's sort of an outlier on the record. It's the, the me- sort of Mexican Spanish song on the record. Right. Yeah. It's, uh, it's made famous by a group we both like from Mexico called Los Panchos. Mm-hmm. Uh, and it's. It's a classic bolero, Spanish Mexican song. Right. Yeah. Um, but yeah, we're and we're really into that style of music, and that's one that stood out to us a lot. Cool. First thing I noticed is Clay got a haircut. <laughs> <laughs> Big news on the street. Yeah. yeah. I you shaved l- my head. Looks good. <laughs> Thank you. You had quite the long hair before. I had long hair before. Yeah, for a long time. Yeah. 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 I'm guessing you guys are in your early twenties. I'm twenty four. Yes. Twenty three. Yeah. How long have you been playing together and what brought you together? Uh, we met in high school. Um, we were both uh, hanging out in the same scene and we both uh, loved music. And I don't know exactly how we met, somewhere at the park or something with yeah. skateboards. Right, just friends first, right? Yeah, and then, uh, you know, just like you do, we're like, hey, we should get together and play some Beatles songs or something and then uh, yeah and then we got together and it was really fun and we've always really enjoyed singing harmonies together and Mm -hmm. playing together and that's kind of uh, yeah just always how it's been yeah yeah yeah. and how did you make a go of it and did did you like set out making uh, the record you know when when did you have the idea to actually record and, and start doing it I guess professionally well, um, <clears throat> we had a band in high school, and we yeah. always played, and, and then we kind of went separate ways. Sam went to Mexico for a while, and I <clears throat> went to school in Northern California, and then uh, we always knew we wanted to get back together and play, and so we just started playing around anywhere we could in L.A., and then um, I guess we sort of hooked up with Brent Radmaker, Right, yeah. And uh, started playing opening shows for him in Gospel Beach. Right, yeah. And then we just started uh, getting closer with all of those guys. And they, um, we owe them a lot of credit Money. for, <laughs> for uh, yeah, where we are now. We've, yeah. That's how we met Dan Horn. Now we, he's like our, our landlord, too. We live in his house. and. Uh, and he's the producer of the record. He made yeah. the record, and yeah, he's a super great dude. And mm-hmm. um, One of the sweetest faces you'll ever meet in your life. <laughs> Huge glasses, and yeah, just a great, yeah. great face. We were speaking to Brent uh, off mic earlier. Uh, oh, sick. I love that guy. You know, he's, he, Beachwood Sparks was a group a long time ago, and then he's with a, he's got Gospel Beach. I think it's his latest project. But yeah, you know, he's just such a, I guess, a great guy to be a bit of a mentor to you, right? Yeah. Yeah. And he played on the record. Yeah, he yeah. played bass. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, he just uh, is, like, super passionate about music and, like, a music scene. Mm-hmm. And I think, uh, yeah, he, like, really lent us a hand and and wanted to like, sort of, like, you know, pass on yeah. a little bit of, like, what he'd been given, I guess. And yeah. You keep know, it going. What I like about Brent and, and you and several other bands is you're proudly Californian. Like, you sound like where you come from, right? And yeah. I, I love that. I love that sound. What do people, what do people call your sound? I, I know a lot of people struggle in terms of what to call styles of music and whatnot, but what are people throwing at you in terms of your sound? Uh, California people? country is kind of one. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's hard to, like, right, yeah. say, say, say Co- it without cos- sounding cosmic, like a dork. But. Cosmic Americana, stuff yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah, all of that stuff. We yeah. love, like, that whole scene from, you know, the Grateful Dead and the birds and the burritos, and that's we draw from that a lot. Yeah, and yeah. We kind of want to expand on that, I guess. You have a cover band called Grateful Shred. <laughs> we do. Yeah, we're in a Grateful Dead cover band, too. Yeah. Do you want to talk about that? No. No. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. There, there are some videos out there. You can check it out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, it's just all fun. We're, we're all roommates, and we all wanted... We were all just playing that music a lot anyways. We're like, we should make a band. Yeah. And then we did, and then we've kind of been playing around, so it's been super fun. Yeah. Got to travel a little bit. And cool. Yeah. yeah. 
Well, I'm glad you guys came up because you I put the record on the top ten. I think it's a really great record. It's a huge some really honor. great songs. And let's hear another song now. This is a uh, Songs to Seagull, right? Uh, yeah. from the self titled <clears throat> debut record Apache. <laughs> Apache in the Roadhouse on KXP from their, I guess, relatively new album. Debut album came out last year. Yeah. About three uh, months. Good to have you guys hear that song, Songs to a Seagull. Do you guys write together? Yeah. Yeah. What comes yeah. first? Uh, more of the, the melody stuff or the lyrics? or? Uh, it's kind of different every time for me. Uh, I guess, I don't know. I can't speak for Clay. But um, <clears throat> sometimes I find it hard to write a melody if I don't have anything good to say. Um, so sometimes if I'm struggling, I try to sit down and figure out what I want to say before I yeah. just start singing. I think you guys said you live together, so you spend a lot of time together. So it's, it's convenient that way, right? I guess whenever yeah, you have Yeah, we share a bedroom, so we <laughs> oh, you do? Okay. sing a lot together in our sleep <laughs> and when we're awake. And uh, yeah, we have a lot of time together. Yeah, what part of Los Angeles are you in? Uh, we're in the east side in Echo Park. Okay, cool. Yeah. You know, you made that video to The Mountain, that song on the album, and it's such a beautiful video, and I wanted to guess as to where that was filmed at. It looks like, you know, how you drive the car, the car is, uh, you know, the show's driving out to the mountain somewhere, and uh, I'm guessing it's Kings Canyon. Am I, am I close? It's uh, Angeles Crest Highway. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's like off the two freeway, like right up against the foothills of Angeles National Forest. I see, yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's right around where we grew up, so. It's a yeah. beautiful area. It's super beautiful. Yeah. 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 
Um, so when you guys uh, tour, what is the crowd like? It's like, different every time. What is your audience? Uh, it's, it's different every time, and we've never had, like, a headlining tour or anything. So anytime we're on the road, it's always, it's always different. Um, right now, we're, we're traveling with Suzanne Santo, and, uh, I mean, the crowds have been pretty good so far. Yeah. Um, it's hard sometimes when it's really loud. We play a lot of loud bars at yeah. home and stuff. So you're acoustic and you're a duo and you gotta, people don't know who you are and they're, and yeah. they're, and they're hanging out. Sometimes they just want to drink and have yeah. a good time yeah. or sometimes we're kind of sad. How do you deal with that? We just I try mean, our best. Yeah. yeah. We always <laughs> have fun and yeah. we always try to give everything we can, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. no matter what the audience is like. Are you writing new songs, or what's for the what's up in the in the new year for you? Are you gonna yeah, make a new record? We're writing a lot of songs. We're kind of trying to figure out uh, what to do about a new record. We're we're not quite there yet, but we're we're trying to write as much as we can and yeah. and kind of uh, give them give the new songs some life on the road and, and try them out too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the label is Spiritual Pajamas, so yeah. they're probably gonna be hounding you pretty soon for. <laughs> A new record. Yeah. They're super, super Need sweet a record. Dudes. Yeah, cool. Yeah. Well, it's great to have you here. I requested a song that I've been playing on the show quite a bit. It's my favorite song from the album. Do you want to play Chico River? Yeah, yeah of our course. pleasure. All right, so Apache in the Roadhouse.
Chico River by Mapache from their debut record came out last year. Great to have you guys on the show, Sam and Clay. Thanks so much. It's a Thank huge you, honor. Yeah. Thank you so Pleasure. much. This is KEXP. Discover new music at listenerpoweredkexp.org.